And take a deep breath in and out. And again, in. And out. Feeling any tension, just releasing from the shoulders, relaxing. And starting with Sahana Vavatu. Many of you already know this mantra, so you can chant along. I will chant a little bit slower, so if you'd like to repeat afterwards, then you can. Om Sahana Vavatu Sahana Bunaktu Sahaviryam Karavavahai Tejasvina vadita mastuma vid vishavahai. Om shanti shanti shanti. chant my next favorite, Hasatoma Satgamaya. This is, let us be led from the unreal or from untruth to truth, from the darkness to the light, from death or what leads us to death to immortality, what leads us to light. Om Asatoma Satgamaya Tamasoma Jyotirgamaya Mrityorma Amritam Gamaya Om Shanti 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 Next, this is calling upon all the elements, so different nature deities um, from the Vedic times to uh, bring good fortune or goodwill, um, goodness to the planet. That's a very, very short <laughs> explanation from. Um, so, Om Shandami Trasham Varunaha Shanno Bavat Variama Shanna Indra Brahaspatihi Shanno Vishnuru Kamaha Namo Brahmane Namaste Vayu Twame Pratyaksham Brahmasi Dwameva Pratyaksham Brahma Vadishyami Ratam Vadishyami Satyam Vadishyami Tanmamavatu Tadvakta Ramavatu Avatu mam, avatu vaktaraham. Om shanti, shanti, shanti.
Next, this is also one of my favorite mantras. Again, um, if you didn't get the link, you can find the link in my Instagram bio. You can download the book there. It's easy to find. It's uh, just a compilation of different peace prayers. Um, this is Badram Karne, Bishrunu Yamadeva. So this one was one of uh, Tabi Joyce's favorite chants, Vedic chants that may we only see what is good or auspicious, maybe we hear what is good and auspicious, may we speak only good and auspicious things and may we be protected in health and in strength. And it goes on a little bit more than that, but that's maybe the essence of this Vedic chant. Badram Karni Bishrunu Yama Deva Badram Pashe Maksha Birya Jatra Stira Rangais Tushtu Vagam Vyashema Deva Hitam Yadayuhu Om Swastina Indro Vritta Shravaha Swastina Pusha Vishva Veda Swastina Stark Show Arishta Nemi Suasti no prahas patir dadatu. Om shanti shanti shanti. And this is a beautiful one. Pur namada, pur namidam, pur nat, pur namudachate. Uh, going on that that referring to pure consciousness, referring to um, you know the ultimate reality in the infinite is full, is perfect. This meaning what's inside of us is full, is perfect, or like the manifest universe, everything we're seeing. Um, this fullness is being projected from that fullness. So, and if you try to take fullness out of fullness, what remains is fullness. So if you, you can't subtract anything from the infinite, it will always remain infinite. So let's chant this one. Oh, poor Namada, poor Namidam, poor Nat, poor Namudachate, poor Nasya. Purnamadaya Purnameva Vashishyate Om Shanti 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 That's kind of a beautiful one. That no matter who we lose in this life, they are still with us. The infinite cannot be added to or subtracted from. So we're always connected. And then this one is a real peace prayer. I mean, they're all real Shanti mantras, real peace prayers, but this one is 
May everyone um, experience auspiciousness or swasti. May everyone experience peace, shanti. May everyone experience that infinity, that sense of fullness, purnam. And may everyone experience prosperity, mangalam, or good fortune. Um, may all be happy. May all be free from disabilities or disasters or problems. May all look to the good of others and may none suffer or have sorrow. So this is a important one for what's happening in our world right now. Om Sarve Sham Swastir Bhavatu Sarve Sham Shantir Bhavatu Sarve Sham Purnam Bhavatu Sarve sham mangalam bhavatu Sarve bhavantu sukino Sarve santu niramaya Sarve patrani pashantu Ma kaschit dukabhagbhave Lokaha samastaha sukino bhavantu Om shanti 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 And a couple more. This one I always love, uh, it's, uh, giving salutations to Brahma, salutations to the fire, the Agni, salutations to the earth, the Praviti, uh, praviti uh, sun salutations to, or salutations, uh, blessings to all the medicinal plants, which are many, um, to our speech, to the master, the God of speech, uh, and to Vishnu, the mystic one, um, the lord of mysticism whoever that is for you so let's call upon some magic and some miracles and some mysticism and also give thanks for all that we have on the planet as well Namo Brahmane, Namo Astvagnaye, Nama Pritivya, Nama Osha Divya, Namo Vache, Namo Vachaspataye, Namo Vishnave Brahate Karomi. Om Shanti 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 Beautiful. Mm. And finally, we'll do the long, longer, longer form, not the longest form of uh, the prayer for world peace uh, comes at the end of the Ishtanga Yoga practice, part of it. We'll just chant uh, another verse, a second verse at the end. Um, but let good things occur in all countries, in all places. Um, let those who are governing the people govern well with wisdom in the path of justice. Please, please. Um, let the animals, all the animals of the world and all the wise humans of the world live in peace and harmony and have a pleasant life. Let all the people of the world be happy. 
And may the rains come in a timely fashion and be plentiful. Let the earth be covered with vegetation so we can be fed. Uh, let all countries live without problems and never let good people live in fear. So this is the uh, Swasti Prajabhyaha invocation. Suasti Prajabhyaha Pari Palayantam Nyayena Margena Mahim Mahishaha Go Brahmanebhyaha Shubhamastu Nityam Lokaha Samastaha Sukino Bhavantu Kale Varshantu Parjanya Priti Visasya Shalini Desho Yam Kshobarahito Brahmana Santu Nirbaya Sarve Bhavantu Sukino Sarve Santu Niramaya Sarve Patrani Pashantu Makas Chittukabhag Bhave Lokaha Samastaha Sukino Bhavantu Om Shanti 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 Yeah. Let's take a deep breath in and releasing out. And let's begin with just a simple alternate nostril breathing, inhaling through the left, exhaling for twice the length through the right. And then again, inhaling back through the right, exhaling for twice the length through the left. Okay, so just beginning with a little reset breath, deep inhale and exhale. At the end of the exhale, closing your right nostril, we'll inhale left. Close, exhale right. Inhale back through the right. Close, exhale left. That's one round. Inhale back through the left. Close, exhale right. Inhale back through the right. Close, exhale left. Inhale back through the left. Close, exhale right. Inhale back through the right. Close, exhale left. Inhale back through the left. Close, exhale right. Inhale back through the right.
close, exhale left. Inhale left. Close, exhale right. Inhale right. Close, exhale left. Inhale left. Close, exhale right. Inhale right. Close, exhale left. Two more rounds. Inhale left. Close, exhale right. Inhale right. Exhale left. One more round. Inhale left. Close, exhale right. Inhale right. And exhale left. and release the hat, take a deep breath in. And release slowly out. Next we'll practice Ujjayi Pranayama, inhaling through both nostrils and exhaling through the left nostril only for twice the length of the inhale. So again, take a reset breath, inhaling and exhale. And inhale through both nostrils. Close the right, exhale left for twice the length of your inhale. Inhale through both. And exhale left. Inhale through both. Exhale left. Making the exhale twice as long as your inhale. Inhale through both. Exhale left. Again, inhale through both. Exhale left. Five more rounds. Inhale through both. Exhale 
Exhale, left. Inhale through both. Exhale, left. Inhale through both. Exhale left. Two more rounds, inhale through both. Exhale left. Inhale through both. And exhale left. Then take a deep breath in. And slowly releasing out. One more deep breath in. And a nice long exhale. We'll do one last pranayama, shitali or sitkari. So if you can curl your tongue, you're going to stick the tongue out about an inch from your lips and inhale through the curled tongue. Good. And then we'll exhale through both nostrils. If you cannot mm, curl the tongue, then you're going to take the tips of the teeth and place them together so that you're smiling kind of like a Cheshire cat. And the tip of the tongue will go behind the teeth. We're going to inhale through the sides of the mouth. And then exhale through both nostrils. So if you can curl the tongue, you can inhale through the curled tongue. That's called shitali. And if you cannot curl your tongue, if it's an impossibility, then tip of the tongue behind the teeth, the teeth together. The air will brush along the sides of the tongue. It's a cooling breath. This is called sitkari. And then exhale through both nostrils. We'll just practice eight times, eight breaths, eight rounds of shitali or sitkari, whatever um, one you choose to do. Okay, so take a deep inhale through both nostrils. And exhale. And then either sticking the tongue out or placing it behind the teeth. And exhale for double the length. And again, inhale through the curled tongue or the sides of the mouth. Exhale for double the length through both nostrils. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, slowly exhaling through both nostrils for twice the length of your inhale. Inhale. Exhale. 
And exhale. Three more breaths. Slow, long exhale. Inhale. Exhale. And then last one. Inhale. And exhale. Take a deep breath in through both nostrils. And exhale. Nice, relaxing breath out. So I'm going to do a little bit of chanting again before we move to the meditation. We're going to chant the Om Gam Ganapataye Namaha, the mantra for Ganesha, Ganapati, uh, the remover of obstacles and um, the opener of doors and gates. So let's um, call upon Ganesha's energy to remove obstacles and to open new doors, especially uh, in the area of Ukraine where there are many obstacles to peace. So this will be a nice one to chant. Om. Gam Ganapataye Namaha. Okay. And we will chant 21 times. Okay. <laughs> Take a deep breath in. Om Gam Ganapataye Namaha. 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 You can just hear the mantra silently. And if it's safe to do so, just close your eyes. See if you can connect to that subtle vibration. Mm. 
that space within, that sacred space within, the inner sanctum of yourself. The hands can be in the lap or on the knees, wherever is comfortable for you. If you wanna stretch out and lie down, you're also welcome to do so. Just feeling your heart center. If it helps for you to connect to that space, you can put a hand or two hands on the heart. And just feeling the space beneath the palm or behind the breastbone. And breathing into that space, breathing into that area. the seat of prana, in the body, of energy, connected to the heart chakra, connected to the breath, to the element of air. Just moving our energy now through the air, through the breath, through space, and time, space and time, just an illusion. Nothing really truly separates us. Everything is infinite, everything is full. Purnamada, Purnamidam, Purnat, Purnamudachate, Purnasya, Purnamadaya. Purnameva Vashishate. Nothing can be taken away or added to what is already infinite. And connecting to that space of infinity within. May I be filled with loving kindness compassion and empathy for myself and others. As you breathe, you can silently repeat those words or just feel that sense of deep connection, compassion, loving kindness or metta within yourself. You can feel it radiating outward. May I be well, healthy, healed, experiencing wholeness, healthy body, strength, healthy mind, intelligence, wisdom. And the whole spirit integrated, connected. May I be peaceful and at ease. Inhaling peace exhale, release, feeling a sense of ease, calm, wash over you. May I be happy, joyful, liberated, enlightened, and free, free from suffering caused by myself or others or the environment. Free from constraints, harsh judgments. And free from intolerance 
free from war, internal war or external war. I'm free to be, to express, to love, to live. I'm taking this beautiful energy within yourself. And if you'd like, you can direct it towards Ukraine, to that region of the world, Eastern Europe area, even Russia, people of Russia who are suffering, and even leaders who are causing suffering. Wouldn't it be amazing they could experience loving kindness, metta, compassion, peace, internal peace to stop creating war externally. If you don't wanna be specific in your directing of this energy, this metta, you can direct it to all beings everywhere because as we know, there's suffering all around. animals, the planet, humans. Taking a moment just to feel our connection, our collective connection, our interconnection and our interdependence on each other, on our world, on this planet the plants, the animals, the beings of the ocean, land, and sky. I'm radiating this energy out, may all be filled with loving kindness, compassion, empathy, for self, for others. May all feel safe. May all feel secure. May all be well, healthy, healed physically, emotionally, psychologically, mentally, spiritually. May what is broken come together and be healed and integrated into a wholeness, into a fullness. May all be peaceful and at ease. May all experience peace, live in peace, abide in peace, extend peace, inner peace, outer peace. And may there be an ease and a flow, an ability to relax into it, to let go and surrender. May all be happy, joyful, liberated, enlightened, and free, free from war, free from invasion, free from suffering caused by self or others, by the environment, by factors beyond control, free from pain, 
free from anguish, free from loss. Free from judgment. Free to love, free to be, free to express. Just take a moment, all those who are at war, who are involved directly, indirectly, whose lives are at risk, putting their lives on the line for greater good, for a higher cause, for dharma, for noble truth. Just take a moment to send the righteous, the just, a little bit of strength, a little bit more energy. And the sense of conviction and peace, courage and bravery, and all those helping people in need. Take a moment to send them courage, energy, bravery, health, good health. For all those suffering, experiencing suffering on any level, physical, emotional, mental, spiritual, take a moment to send them love, loving kindness, metta, Compassion, empathy, healing, freedom from suffering, freedom from pain. A sense of peace. And then coming home back to your heart center, back to that inner sanctuary, that space behind your breastbone connected to the prana, to the heart center, the heart of your heart, your spiritual center, your essence, the I-ness of the eye. A place that's never changed. The spark of the divine. And again, filling our own cup so that we can also do good and be good in the world and help others. May I be filled with loving kindness. May I be safe. May I be secure. May I have compassion for myself and others and express empathy in helping. May I be well, healthy, healed, having that sense of being whole, complete, integrated and connected to the infinite at all times, in all places, in all ways. May I be peaceful and at ease. Trusting, allowing, and connected to flow. May I be happy, joyful, liberated, enlightened and free, free to love, free to play, free to express 
that divine inner essence, that spark of creativity, God within, God without, spirit within, spirit without. Take a deep breath in. Just feel that fullness, that suspension at the top of the breath. And exhale, release. Again, deep breath in. Feeling that sense of fullness, Purna. Exhale, release. One more deep, full breath. And if you'd like, you can just rub your thumb and your first finger together, creating sensation between the tips of the fingers, feeling all of that sensation. And slowly bringing the other fingers in to the mix, feeling all of the ridges, the texture, maybe it's smooth or slippery feeling. And then bringing the whole palm together with your other palm, all of the fingers against all the other fingers, creating heat, creating energy. And then when you feel ready, if you'd like, you can place the hands just over the eyes. On the forehead, absorbing that energy, taking it in and coming into your space. We just want to chant Om Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. And then we can open up for questions if you'd like and have a short talk. Oh Shanti 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 Om Shri Guru Bhyo Namaha Hari Om Thank you so much for joining today. It was wonderful to have you.